Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So last week, Microsoft rolled out the Windows 10 22H2 optional bug fix update for August KB5029331. And as I posted in that video, which I'll leave a link to in the description, it included a new Windows backup app that lets you back up your folders, your apps, your settings, your credentials, and so on. And if you want more info regarding the app, just go check that video out. Now, over and above the new Windows backup app that rolled out last week with KB5029331, a little feature that has basically gone unnoticed is a small little button that's been included as part of the backup app in the File Explorer of Windows 10 after applying that update. So if we head over to the File Explorer for Windows 10 and we just expand our ribbon, so we can expand the ribbon if you haven't done so already by clicking the chevron in the top right, and we head over to our Documents folder in the left-hand navigation pane, you'll see now that there is a new Start Backup button, which now lets you back up your documents, pictures, downloads, and so on from Windows 10, and that syncs with OneDrive. So if you click on that, it launches and opens OneDrive and the Backup Important Files in OneDrive dialog and menu. So obviously, um, this is a OneDrive feature, and if you click on Choose Folders, it takes you over to the settings of OneDrive where you can actually check the um, different folders like documents, pictures, desktop, music videos, and so on that you want backed up. And then you just click Start Backup, and that will um, start syncing those folders to your OneDrive account. Obviously, if you have enough um, storage space uh, um, in your OneDrive account. So if you click Start Backup, Back up important files in OneDrive, and you can obviously start that backup directly from the dialog that appears after clicking that button. And this is interesting because uh, Microsoft did say a while back that Windows 10 wasn't really going to be getting uh, any new features. And last week we received the Windows Backup app. And now, as mentioned, we've got the new Start Backup button that's now part of the File Explorer that lets you back up important files and sync those with OneDrive and just bringing this to your attention in case you didn't know and are using a feature and would find that useful. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.